y'all welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Niara Alexis and like the title of this video says I'm gonna be showing you my hair maintenance for relaxed hair from wash day to wash day girl Sorry, I'm parched. This is day one, okay? I washed my hair earlier today. If you're curious about like how I do that process of how I wash and blow dry and how I style it and everything, check in the description bar below. I have a full video. That's like my relaxer day routine, but the later half that you see, like where I blow dry and style, that's the same process I did today. Go to that video, all the products is linked over there. So yeah, this is day one. Day one is always a good day for me. Always a good day for me. Love day one hair. Okay y'all, so our quality has changed because I'm on my phone now. I just, I couldn't hold the camera up. So this is end of day two, so my hair is looking like. So today I went out, but it was a little humid, a little muggy. Um, and that's why my hair, like the curls, the waves are kind of non-existent. Like some parts of my hair, I don't know if you can tell, are like borderline straight. Because I knew it was gonna be a little humid out, I did spray hairspray on. So now I'm about to get ready for bed and I said I was gonna show you guys how I pin curl my hair at night, so let's do that. So at night, I'm not putting any additional products on my hair. Um, if you're struggling with like your hair getting like really greasy and oily looking um, really quickly, it could be like either one, the type of products you're using or how much products you're using. Take my first section of hair about this big. You need to pin curl it with the bend of the curl. I have like a slight bend right here. You see how my hair is kind of like falling that way? So that's what I'm gonna, I'm gonna go based off of this one right here. Here I'm gonna take my hand and I flip my hair back and I clip it down. And I also have this hair down here that also kind of naturally has a bend right here, if you can see. So I want to make sure that when I grab an additional piece of hair, I'm also grabbing this hair too. End of this piece is getting like a full curl, so like the full wave is happening. So I did the same thing, flipped it back on itself. Last section back here, this hair back here is actually like really straight. I'm gonna, I need to pin this like higher up to give it more of a of a curl in the back. Okay, all my hair is pinned back. Um, I don't recommend you sleeping on just a silk pillowcase with this. Your hair is gonna get end up all tangled up. That's how I get ready for bed. So then we'll come back tomorrow morning and I'll show you what my hair looks like when I take it down. Because I just... All right, y'all. So next time, can y'all see me good? So this is what my hair is looking like straight out the pin curls. I don't brush my hair or anything because like I just want whatever I have here to hold as long as it possibly can. I just run my fingers through it and just kind of mess it up. Okay, I had to fix that angle, sorry. I feel like it was kind of cut super short down here. But this is what my hair looks like. Um, and the one thing that I always look at and pay attention to is the humidity. To try to preserve my hair, I will carry a hat with me and I will carry a claw clip like this with me. Since I know it is gonna be kind of humid out, one thing I am gonna do is put like some spray on here. Here we are clipped up. I told you guys it wasn't nothing. It's not cute. It's not cute by any means. It's to hold the hair back. So I don't know if you can like see the clip really well back there. So I'm at my mom's house. I walked over here. It's like a 20-ish minute walk. So I'm gonna take my hair out my clip so, ooh, so you can see what it looks like. This is what it's looking like. It preserved my hair a lot better than just like walking wood. All right, y'all. So it's 10 o'clock in the morning. This is day four. Hair. If it's not the correct date on me down here. Um, day four here. This is what we're looking like. Some some pieces are a little limp. Like some just like could not hang. Like these pieces. I'm not gonna put any heat on my hair though. I don't. I did try to put a few extra like curls in the back, like pink curls in the back. But sometimes it just be like that. All I put on my hair today was hairspray to kind of try to help keep whatever curl I have and a little bit of the verb dry ghost oil spray. Ow, okay, look, let me just say, these metal clips are cute. They work sometimes. 
but sometimes they snag your hair like nobody's business. But so. I'm about to get ready to work out. Low key, I haven't really been working out as much as I usually do. Um, and I have this little headband thing. It's called like dry sweat. I'll link it down below. Um, but this is what I'm be using to maintain my hair. Cause I know a lot of us be like, hair or workout, hair or workout. I do think I should also mention like I'm not much of a sweater and I'm also not doing very like sweat intensive workouts. I'm doing low impact workouts that still get the job done. So I'm not out here running five miles with this thing on, doing cardio on the Stairmaster and all this stuff. No. Hey y'all, so it is day four, five. I can't remember clearly. Whatever day it is, I haven't put anything in my hair. The only thing I did spray a little bit in my hair this morning was like a little bit of hair perfume. I'll link it down below. If my hair is starting to get a little flat or I feel like it's getting a little oily or something, just flip that part, girl. It'll just add like a lot more volume to your hair. You see how like now it just looks like so, it looks like a little zhuzh, you know? If you hear something back there, it's because people live in this house. This is real life. Um, I wanted to show you what I do to my hair sometimes when I get in the shower. Now sometimes I get in the shower my hair is fully wrapped up. Like you'll see like I'll have my scarf on and everything, but sometimes I don't. Just like this. And I'm just gonna put a shower cap on top of it. And I'll get in the shower just like this. If you wanna be extra secure, you can obviously like put a scarf on top of it or whatever, but I don't feel like it. Okay y'all, today is day six. I'm just getting my setup here. Today is day six. Um, and I kind of started my routine already. So I was like, let me catch this on film for then. So my hair today is like the first day feeling kind of greasy. Like it feels, it doesn't feel stiff down here. There's less movement, but it just like feels like a little bit greasier. So I'm just using the Heritage by Mindy uh, Soak It Up Dry Conditioner. Um, it's the same thing as a dry shampoo. I'm just gonna take it, I spray it at the roots, and I rub it in really good. And that's my hair today. Um, and then I did just wanna share, because I do do this like every couple of days or so, I use a hair perfume. Um, today, this one is by, um, this is the Maison Francis, you know, the Baccarat Rouge 540. Um, I'll link it down below. I did a review, they have a hair scent and this is like $60. I just kinda do like, Oh my gosh, you guys. You know how like there's like a little stick that goes down from the perfume up to the nozzle? It has fallen off and it's just floating in the perfume. I was trying to figure out why this wasn't, and now it won't spray out anymore. That was the last one. I hope that doesn't do that on the actual perfume. Cause I paid $400 for that. I want my money back. Okay y'all, so it's still day five. I'm walking to the dry cleaners in my mom's house now, but like, once I kind of get to this stage, it's like put a hat on type of deal. So that's how I'm looking today. All right, y'all. It is Friday, day seven. A little, little day of drift. Um, if you hear my dishwasher going over there, we trying to clean. Okay, so day seven, I just have my hair pulled back in this claw clip. This is like the absolute end of my hair. Like the ends are fine. Like they're still like a little loose, but they're nowhere near as like, like this, like how my hair was looking before, it was glossy, it was shining, it was ooh, ooh, ooh. You guys ask me all the time, how do I maintain my hair in between washes? My hair does not stay like that. And I don't think it's realistic for you to expect your hair to stay like that from like a week, two weeks after you done got it done. It's not, boo. But yeah, this is my full wash day to wash day. Little hair vlog. I hope it was helpful for you guys. I always get questions on how I maintain my hair. Everything I talked about in this video, well, I will link it down below. You ain't even gotta ask me, girl. It's a link down there, okay? So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time.